afternoon to all my penny glitch clearance um, holiday whatever shoppers um, easy penny shopping here and so I apologize I've been MIA and I apologize for me in this video uh, I'm sicker than a dog I don't know why that's a saying I don't know if dogs get sicker than humans but whatever I'm sick um, my mom got shingles a couple weeks ago. That was a nightmare. Then my kiddo got stink eye. For those of you that don't know, that's pink eye. And then I got the stink eye. And then I got better for like two days. And then this happened. I don't even know, okay? I have um, definitely used a number of, you know, cold things. And I am loopy. And I am here kind of but I need to tell you this this is important stuff otherwise I wouldn't have got off the couch um, I wouldn't have taken a shower because I would I, well, I wouldn't have got off the couch so um, we need to talk about Dollar General like early activation glitches all right because so we have these happen and when they happen they're only good for a small window of time and unfortunately, we only find out about them right at almost in pretty much the end of the day, almost for East Coasters. But West Coasters would still have a couple more hours. So I want to talk about glitches, early activation, all right, and explain because I know a lot of people have asked questions. Clearly, we had the last one. Um, that Christie's Connections posted about the Christmas stuff. And yes, I did go out there and get stuff. That's in this video. Um, I did it wrong, just so you know. There it is. But I didn't know. So anywho, um, this can happen. And I want to teach you guys how to, I guess, watch for this to happen. So then you won't be caught off guard. You will be prepared and ready to run when it actually happens. I'm going to try not to. Okay, I'm going to sniffle in this. I'm going to try not to blow my nose, but I probably will. I look like Rudolph. I guess that's a good thing. But anyways, my nose is shiny. It's red. I have chapstick on it. I have Vicks on it. I have lotion, Kleenexes. Um, I am a mess, but you guys need to know this stuff. Okay, because word on the DG street is we could have more tonight. All right, this is Saturday. December 23rd. I don't even want to think about that. I need to be wrapping presents right now or I probably should be going out and getting last minute things. I don't know what's happening. So what you want to do is basically early activation, Dollar General glitch is when two sales overlap. All right. So what you want to do is you have to pay attention to the weekly Dollar General ads. So if you go on your DG app right now, then you will see, and I'm going to pop it up on the screen for you, the browse the weekly ads. Okay, you're going to click on that, and it's going to take you to the weekly ad. It's going to say it ends tomorrow. All right? So basically, it's good until midnight. All right. But then, there the new sale comes, right? And the new sale should come tomorrow. It should start at midnight. Okay, one should end at midnight, one should start at midnight. But with Dollar General, we have a lot of instances where the one sale ends at midnight, but the new sale starts early activation at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. All right, so we have a window of 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. or 9 p.m. 
however long your stores are open, where it's like things are doubling up. It's like a double dip situation, right? Now, um, thank you. I'll just say Kat for messaging me um, about the uh, stores staying open till 11. So it seems that we have some stores that are staying open later because of Christmas. So some of these stores, they're not closing till 11 p.m. So then that's going to give you an even bigger window to hit this early activation double dip situation. Okay, so early activation means a sale is kicking in early. It's going to start typically at 7 p.m. the night before instead of midnight. And there's already a sale going. And then those sales come together and they make pennies or they make very low out of pocket. So last week we had with the, um, okay, so uh, it was like trim a tree, basically. Um, the ornaments, the stockings, the garlands, the, I don't know what all I got. Oh, the outside, it wasn't even all trim a tree. There was outside decor. But if you paid attention to the ad, or it shows you on your app sometimes. So some of those were, you know, say buy one, get one free. Okay. And then the new sale, they were going to be half off. So those two things combined. And for whatever reason on the new systems and self checkouts, when we have a BOGO situation plus a half off situation, it equals a penny. There's a glitch in the matrix of DG. Well, one of many. So we had the decor and such. Some of it was sitting at half off. That early activation made it BOGO. And then that equaled a penny. And vice versa. So we had some that were BOGO. They were going half off. They came together. They equaled pennies. I, I, I'm not a mathematician. Um, but... I hope that makes sense. So these are sales overlapping. Now, clearly this was in regards to Christmas stuff, but that doesn't always have to be the case either. What you have to do is really compare this week's ad with the new ad to see what items are currently on sale for this. And then if they're also going to be in the new ad on sale for something else, where when that kicks in early, is that going to cause, you can get them for a cent or you can get them for 50 cents or, you know, this could be on anything. This could be soda. This could be sheets. We've had obviously the sheet situation in the past and it was the same thing or similar thing. They mistakenly put on two sales. So the sale was, you know, buy one, get one free, but then they also had the sheets marked down half off. And it seems when you got half off and BOGO, they make pennies. Okay. So supposedly there are supposed to be, or uh, a glitch this evening, many glitches, I don't know. Um, so definitely be ready. Again, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Now, I know like Christy and her team, they watch this stuff ahead of time. So they, if something happens, they already have a video ready. So it's going to pop out literally right away. So good for you guys. I watch. I'll miss it. When you say put your shoes on, I put my shoes on. Again, I know that so many people were confused um, they went the next day to try to get stuff, the Christmas stuff, and they didn't understand why it didn't work. So again, short period of time where we have two sales coming together and those two sales equal super cheap or pennies. Hey everybody, it's E, Easy Penny Shopping. We're at the Dollar General for a run glitch deal. Christy's connections. Christy, you know I love you. Christy said to run. I don't run but I drove a little fast. This store doesn't have much left as far as I, I wanted the outdoor decor, but whatever, we're gonna try some garlands, some ornaments, tree skirts, and see if this happens. I mean, I assume it'll happen. Let's see if it happens. Luckily, I know the kid that works here, so he won't mind if I'm 
doing 12 transactions at the self-checkout. Scan your items now. What the DGs? That's right. I'll go ahead and pay that with cash. <laughs> That's fine. I'll be gone. Who are you gonna tell? What are they gonna do? I'm gonna tell Jesus. What are you gonna do that? Taking advantage of poor little Dollar General. Poor little <laughs> Monopoly Dollar General? No, I don't feel bad. And Jesus would not condone how Dollar General has became a monopoly. Exactly. So, I think Jesus would be all about a good deal. He's about helping the poor. Don't you know that? Poor. Well, that too. I built a blessing box. I already did that part. So now, I have to get decorations for people. Hey, you know I help a lot of people. I even gave you a dinosaur pillow. And you're 37. <laughs> Come on, you can do it. Thank you.